Welcome back to Panoi Crossover. Still with us are the ladies from the Box Out brand. We're going to talk about some NBA topics, see their opinions. Marky Mark, take it away. What, what are we going to talk about? We're going to talk about what's up in the NBA. And since once this airs, it's going to be the All-Star weekend, I want to ask you guys, this is going to be basically the first half of the season. What have you guys, you know, noticed so far about, you know, watching the first half of the season? What have been your, what have been your favorite thing that happened so far? Um, for me, it's honestly watching the Raptors make their way up to the first in the Eastern Conference. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's they are. amazing yeah, for definitely. the Raptors. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's they've, so true. They've really excelled compared yeah. to years ago. Yeah. Playing really good, playing as a team, I find. Mm -hmm. Playing that's amazing. Then you guys, this. Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay, so I'm going to just uh, jump on the other side okay. here. Um, Chris Paul's my favorite player, so when he got traded to Houston, um, just watching how he plays on Houston compared to how he was in LA, it was just uh, a little bit change to see how him and uh, James Harden were playing together and how they would match because they're both like guards, right? So mm -hmm. I'm just yeah. seeing that. So we got the Toronto season, we got the Houston. <laughs> the Chris Paul season. The Chris Paul season. <laughs> Chris Paul. CJ, what, what? I think just adding thing? on to what she said, like, yeah. which one? This, <laughs> this year, just, just with a lot of trades going on lately, I feel like it's better for a lot of people to shine in terms of, like, Kyrie. He, he's gotten in more playtime, yeah, I think. That's very true. He's gotten more time to really show what he has and more yeah. talent. Um, that just goes for, like, everybody that's been traded, like mm -hmm. Jimmy Butler, you know? I think with him and Wiggins. Um, like it's not more so Wiggins just handling the team now, it's both of them working together. Mm -hmm. So you you were excited about all the transactions and all yeah. the new faces. I and mean, we talked about that, the new faces in the different jerseys, yeah. right? Yeah, Cleveland just made a bunch of, just a reset of their whole team. So yeah. it's mm -hmm. just been a lot of. Okay, let's move on to who do you, who's your, you already probably answered who your favorite, is your favorite team exactly that? Do Toronto's your favorite team? Yeah, Elder stick C with my hometown, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. T-06, yeah. you know? Yeah. got a rep, yeah. yeah. Favorite, yeah. favorite team as well, is that you, or no, is you just like Chris Paul? <laughs> <laughs> you like State Park. Yeah. Wherever yeah. Chris Paul goes, that's my favorite <laughs> team. Pretty much, yeah. yeah, it's sad to say, but yeah, I'm that girl. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, I'm a Black Mamba fan. Oh. Too bad he's not there anymore, but I mean, like, DeRozan, you can't go wrong with him. He's, mm. he's really shined lately. He is, he's doing really well. So Toronto, yeah. Tor uh, Toronto. They're first in the, in the East home. right now, so yeah. you gotta, you gotta, you gotta stick with yeah. them. All right, let's jump on. Who's your MVP? Mm. Who, who would you say is playing the best? this season. See, I can hop on DeRozan and say because he's a leading scorer of Toronto, but I do have a thing for Kyrie. I don't know why, just the way he plays. Mm -hmm. He just sounded became my favorite player. Mm -hmm. We already <laughs> know what Danielle is. So <laughs> so <we're> going... <laughs> CJ, who's been here? Like I said already, it's, it's Kobe, man. I'm a Kobe fan, but in the league right now, I'd yeah. say, I'd really say it's DeRozan. Like, people have the argument of, of him being the number one Raptor. I think it's true. Yeah. I think yeah. it's true. He's about, yeah, but if they're first in the East right now, there's no argument that he should be in the top, in the ladder Definitely. in terms of MVP Definitely, race, yeah. right? Yeah. So, who's your MVP? My MVP this season, like, I'm a, I'm a Warriors fan, so I'm always, <laughs> like, nobody likes me because I'm a Warriors fan, but I've actually been, like, I've been, Steph Curry, I think, was the best player they have right now, even though the rant's been like, good, but I think Steph Curry is the key, so. Mm. But they're not playing as well as they did last year, so they're not going to get yeah. any. Yeah. No one said LeBron, I'll say LeBron. <laughs> LeBron, LBJ, come on. No. He, he made that trade happen, so I don't know. I don't. He made He's, all that reset of yeah. dumping all his players. I don't like that. So, all right, let's talk about the All Star Weekend. When this airs, it'll be the All Star Weekend. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, what are you guys most excited about the All Star Weekend, or do you even watch the All Star Weekend? That, that's another question. So, um, I do here and there. It's, like, it's every other year. I don't know why. It's yeah. never mm. consistent. Um, I'm looking forward to the team LeBron versus Team Curry. Mm. You know, that's that's what it is. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's what I'm that's, looking forward to. Yeah. Danielle. Yeah. Um. My favorite, I guess, part of All-Star Weekend is kind of the Rising Stars. Um, oh, yeah. mm -hmm. Just because you get to see, like, you know, newcomers, um, yeah, rookie true. sophomores mm -hmm. play, and they get to really shine and mm -hmm. kind of, you know, show everyone who they are, because I feel like a lot of, you know, rookies and sophomores coming into the league, a lot of people don't really know who they are, yeah. so, mm -hmm. you know, it's kind of their chance to mm -hmm. kind of show that. Actually, they're more exciting. Actually, been watching some of the All Star game. They're more exciting to watch than the All Star game. Mm -hmm. I don't yeah. know. That's true, this yeah. past few years, the, all, the Rising Star have been more because these guys want to prove themselves. Like, yeah. yo, um, they're gonna be the next All Star. It's like how Box Out Brown wants to prove that they're <laughs> gonna be the largest co-ed. We will be league. soon, soon, very soon. He set that up pretty well. He set that up. Huh? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, crossover. <laughs> oh. <laughs> CJ, what, uh, what are your thoughts? Oh, I'm excited for the dunk contest. Mm. Ooh. Me being like what, a dunker, two? a fellow yeah. dunker. Yeah. Yeah. Five, two. Yes. Yes. I can barely touch him, not even rim, the mesh, you know. Yeah. But like, it's it's cool to see 
it's like heartbreaking when your favorite player gets dunked on. It's like, man, he was already, yeah. you know? Yeah. So to see these guys show their talent, see so far, mm. like how far they can jump, how high they can jump, mm. it's yeah. the athleticism, I think. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. And who's, who's in the who's dunk it? contest? Let's see. Who, yeah, who, who, who do you want to win the dunk contest since you're the one that's uh, excited to win? Oladipo, Dennis Smith, Larry Nance. I say Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell. Yeah. Mitchell. Mitchell? Yeah, yeah, he's nice. He has his, nice His tops. highlights have been he really has nice cool. Bunnies, yeah. bunnies. Who do you guys think is going to win? Team LeBron or Team Steph? What are you guys are rooting for? Team LeBron or Team Steph? Uh, team Steph. I don't want to agree with you, but Team Steph. I'll go yeah. Steph too. <laughs> well, all of LeBron's uh, players have been injured, like Kevin yeah. Love, yeah. Porzingis, so like yeah. Cousins. Yeah. So all of you guys are being replaced. So yeah, I can, I'm Steve, Team Steph. Team Steph. Yeah. Team Steph. Yeah. I'm Team LeBron. Team Steph. Has to be one. Has to be one. The king. Has to be one, yeah. All right, three point competition. Who are the Devin Booker? Ooh, Devin Booker. I like Devin He's Booker. Nice. He's nice. Paul George, Clay, Kyle Lowry. I know you. I know you. Like, shout out. Shout out to you. Chris Paul. Paul. No, I'm kidding. It's not there, no so you can't vote. <laughs> Tobias Harris, <laughs> Wayne Ellington, Eric Gordon, Bradley Beal. Three point competition. Who, who's your money on? Who was the nicest jumper out of all the guys? Who do you guys th think has the prettiest jumpers? The prettiest. Yeah. The one that just looks nice. It doesn't have to go in. It in just terms looks of pretty. looks, yeah. I think Bradley, but I've, yeah. I'm going, I'm rooting for Gordon right now. Eric Gordon. Gordon. Yeah, he yeah. has a weird looking shot, but it goes but in. But it goes in reason. all the yeah. time, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you too? What do you think? I'll go. I'll stick with Clay. I'll, I'll change oh, it up a little bit. I'll yeah. stay with Clay. He's, you know, he's one. The closest name to Chris Paul is Clay. <laughs> Chris Clay. Clay. You know. Chris, Chris Clay. <laughs> Just change right. a little bit. Yeah. And then who are you going um, with? See, I could go with Kyle, but I'm sticking with Clay. I mean. Yeah, I was yeah. telling her actually on the way here that mm. the way Kyle, like, I don't like how he has to like get prepared and all that. Clay just kind of you know just goes, yeah. just yeah. goes for it. He's, he's Kyle has to warm up. He's, he's automatic. Yeah, he's yeah. Kyle has it's the way they like, shoot. Yeah, yeah, the way they shoot. Kyle turns a little bit more, so he needs more time to kind yeah. of just. Where Clay's just like it just goes. Yeah, automatic. You're yeah. probably yeah. sleeping like. So <laughs> like that so I don't know if you guys play 2K, but it's one of those like you're playing 2K, you're using Golden State, and you accidentally click pass, but he goes for the shot, and it's like still goes in because it's so quick. Yeah, the game slide. <laughs> All right, since we're coming to the end, maybe let's do some, do some predictions. The next half of the season, what are you guys hoping? What are you guys hoping for this, uh, for any teams or, I don't know, what, what do you guys What do you just want to see more happen? Yeah. I want the Raptors to keep first, you know, Eastern Conference. Mm. Um, <laughs> I don't know, I just want to see them continue to build because they're a really yeah. good team. Like, and they're, they're still a young team, they're only a Canadian team. They have so much potential. I just want to mm. see them grow. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, Danielle? Uh, just a touch on the Raptors. I'll give I'll give them yes, one girl. pointer. <laughs> yeah. um, their uh, second lineup is uh, pretty crazy. If you guys yeah. look yeah. at it, yeah. like, bench mob, the best, yeah, the best, best bench in the NBA. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Those rookies and mm -hmm. everything. I it's just want to see them go all the way. So, I mean, they're up and coming. They yeah. have so yeah. much potential. So finals, yeah. finals prediction is Golden State and uh, Raptors. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Raptors yeah. take yeah. the yes, ring. That's what I'm <laughs> Raptors I don't mind hey, the town will go crazy. Right. Oh my gosh. Will, we'll have to box out people from like, <laughs> yeah. the clubs. <laughs> All right. Us. That ends our show for today. Uh, thank you guys for joining Thanks us. Thank you for having us. us. PJ here, anything you'd like to say before we end? I just want to say thank you to all the fans and mm. female balls out there. Mm. Be inspired here. <laughs> I want to see more female ballers mm -hmm. out there. Absolutely. Absolutely. Anything you'd like to say to the audience before we end? Uh, I just want to say thank you for having us mm. and yes. to the female ballers out there just just try and live your dream whether yes. it's through us hopefully through us <laughs> um, we'll try and an outlet just, for you. yeah <laughs> let's let's make us live your dream definitely mm. come yeah. check us out March 11th Crestwood from Troy College definitely see you there <laughs> stick to your goal the only one talk you down from it no we're about up there it is thank you guys for joining us and hey remember stay balling yes